नेचुरल कलामिटीज नेचुरल कलामिटीज डिजास्टर नेचुरल फिनोमिना दैट डैमेज लाइफ एंड प्रॉपर्टी ऑन अर्थ अलोंग विथ ब्रिंगिंग अबाउट चेंजेस इन द लैंड फॉर्म्स एंड वॉटर बॉडीज आर टर्म्ड एज नेचुरल कलामिटीज Sometimes natural calamities are also caused due to drastic climatic and weather changes. Earthquakes, volcanoes, cyclones, tsunamis, floods, wildfires and droughts are some examples of natural disasters. earthquakes the shaking of the ground or the earth's crust due to internal changes or disturbances is called tremor some tremors are so strong that they cause buildings bridges and other structures to collapse the scientific study of earthquakes is called seismology seismology greek word seismos means earthquake and logi means study of measuring earthquakes the richter scale is used to measure the intensity of earthquakes it is named after its developer Charles Richter the noted physicist who developed it in 1935 the richter scale is marked from levels 1 to 10 at the epicenter the point on the earth's surface directly above which the interior part of the earth's crust ruptures is called the epicenter The intensity of an earthquake is felt only beyond the level of 3.5 on the scale. Earthquakes which strike beyond 7 on the Richter scale are considered massive and highly devastating. Effects of earthquakes. Earthquakes cause immense damage and destruction of life and property this includes the following man made structures like buildings parks roads and railways bridges and dams sometimes collapse landslides flash floods and wildfires are also some harmful effects of earthquakes the surface of the earth also gets deformed creating major changes many a times underwater earthquakes cause tsunamis and strong tidal waves immediate steps to be taken when an earthquake occurs one should run outside into the open one should not enter his or her building immediately after the earthquake if in a building then one should stand in the corner of the room safeguarding their head with their arms this is advised as the corners are the strong areas of any building if traveling one should stop and stand aside in the open away from trees etc tsunamis tsunamis are caused by underwater earthquakes underwater volcanic eruptions or a landslide in an area where a huge volume of water is displaced causing massive destruction underwater earthquakes and volcanoes 
result in giant waves, which sometimes reach heights of over 30 meters, that is 100 feet. When these huge waves crash ashore, they often cause widespread destruction. These waves can reach areas even thousands of kilometers away. The undersea earthquake in the Indian Ocean triggered a series of devastating tsunamis on December 26, 2004. It struck the coasts of most of the land masses bordering the Indian Ocean, causing 100 feet waves and killing over 2,25,000 people in 14 countries. The worst affected areas included Indonesia, Sri Lanka, India, Thailand, Myanmar, and Malaysia. Tsunamis can also be caused due to nuclear explosions or when outer space objects such as meteorites, asteroids, or comets fall on the earth close to or into a sea. Effects of Tsunami Tsunamis destroy coastal life and property. A lot of reconstruction activities need to be initiated. Affected people need supplies of clothing, food, medicines, drinking water and bedding on a daily basis. Clearing of leftover debris becomes an utmost priority in order to prevent spread of diseases. Natural Calamities Volcanic Eruptions An opening or rupture on the Earth's crust through which molten rock or magma flows out is called a volcano and the release of lava, ash, gases is referred to as a volcanic eruption. These openings mostly occur on elevated landforms called volcanic mountains. Magma is the molten rock found in the interior of the earth but is termed as lava when it flows out on the surface of the earth as volcanic eruption. Facts about Volcanoes 70% of all volcanic eruptions occur under the ocean. The ash cloud released during eruptions can be dangerous. It can be harmful for people to breathe and difficult for planes to fly. A large ash cloud from Ayufjallu Jorkutl, a volcano in Iceland, led to shutdown of most of the airports in Europe for several days in 2010. The tallest volcano in the solar system is on Mars. Olympus Mons on Mars is a giant shield volcano that rises to an elevation of 27 kilometers and measures 550 kilometers across. The summit of Volcano Chimborazo in Ecuador is the farthest point from the center of the earth. Chimborazo is not the highest mountain by elevation above sea level, but its location along the equatorial bulge makes its summit the farthest point on the Earth's surface from the Earth's center. Effects of Volcanic Eruptions A volcanic eruption releases lava, ash and gases 
into the atmosphere from the opening or crack in the earth's crust. The gases and ash have an adverse effect on the respiratory tract and eyes. The lava burns everything that comes in its way into ash and modifies or creates new landforms. The Deccan Plateau and Hawaiian Island are volcanic in origin. When volcanic gas cloud mixes with the atmospheric water vapor, it leads to formation of acid rain. Victims need complete rehabilitation as areas damaged by volcanoes become unfit for settlements. Cyclones Cyclones are powerful winds that circulate about a center of low atmospheric pressure. These are caused due to creation of low pressure zones over the seas. Cyclones are common in and around Bay of Bengal in the northern Indian Ocean. They bring heavy rains and strong surges of winds that are highly destructive. In the North Indian Ocean, cyclones are more common in months from April to December. Tropical storms in the northern and southwestern Indian Ocean are called cyclones. They rotate clockwise. In the Atlantic and Northern Pacific Ocean, these cyclones are called hurricanes. In Northwestern Pacific, they are called typhoons. Both typhoons and hurricanes rotate anti-clockwise. The Katrina hurricane that struck the northwestern coast of America in August 2005 is one of the four fiercest storms which the US has known. It had winds moving at a speed of 175 miles per hour. Nearly 2,000 people died as cities were flooded, buildings were destroyed and thousands of residents were forced to flee their homes. Effects of Cyclones The strong surging winds carry water into the land areas causing damage to life, property and natural surroundings. Hurricanes can cause damage to property worth billions of dollars every year as well as to natural surroundings. These storms can also change the landscape of an area resulting in hills, roads and trails being washed away. They lead to tremendous loss of life. Dead bodies lying in the open can cause outbreak of diseases. The victims get cut off from the world for all practical purposes and thus need supplies of clothing, food, medicines, drinking water and bedding. Floods Cyclonic floods occur in coastal areas but many inland areas face floods from overflowing rivers due to heavy rains. The Himalayan River Kosi is called the Sorrow of Bihar because every year it overflows and causes floods after heavy rainfall. To prevent floods, we can build dams and interconnected canal systems, etc. Floods are the most common natural disaster in India. 
droughts droughts are caused when an area receives little or no rain for a large period of time in such places the earth's surface gets parched and cracked lakes rivers and streams become dry and underground water table goes down drastically droughts have the most adverse effect on farmers droughts result in death of cattle and livestock droughts cause shortage of drinking water drying up of crops and a jump in prices of essential commodities like food items sugar etc role of the government the government issues forecasts and warnings the government reaches out to save and evacuate victims it opens rehabilitation centers with food clothing water and medicine supplies the government keeps food grain stocks reserved for such adverse times these stocks of food medicine and water are also called buffer stocks many volunteers and non government organizations provide emergency medical help as well as rehabilitation measures